Hello, I'm Jill Clark, former England international badminton player and now commentator for our dynamic and globally popular sport. This week, as we celebrate our 300th edition of Badminton Unlimited, I have something special for you. The story of badminton. It's believed that it all began about 2,500 years ago. While it's uncertain exactly how the shuttlecock came into existence, there are records of children in China playing with a similar looking toy. It had feathers attached to a base and they'd kick it around for hours. This game was called Ti Zian Zi, dating back to the 5th century BC. Still played today, it is now known as Jian Zi in China or chapte around other parts of Asia. Historically, the shuttlecock was made of feathers with rubber or cork attached to the base. Unlike in China, where the shuttlecocks were kicked, in Europe the game involved hitting it with wooden paddles and later on with especially made rackets called battle doors. Ancient Greece has been one of the originators for battledore and shuttlecock some 2,000 years ago. By the 17th century, Le Jeu du Voulon, exactly translated to the flying game, had become an aristocratic pastime. Those are the different stories around the origins of the traditional game, better known as battledore and shuttlecock. Here is what we know for sure. Badminton evolved from this ancient pastime. 